Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to iTouch App Reviewers. In this video, I've just got a quick one. Uh, this is a feature that's actually hidden in iOS 12 that Apple did not announce at WWDC for whatever reason, uh, but it is making some news. And uh, this one's from redmondpie.com, a pretty reliable source. And I've seen this other places as well. So iOS 12 is going to feature a built-in reporting of spam texts and calls. So for those of you that get tons of spam calls and spam texts, you guys can easily report these uh, in iOS 12. So we're not exactly sure how this works yet, but it appears from this text uh, that this is going to work by a third-party app being installed on the phone. And then whenever you get a spam call, you can go in your call log and report that number straight from there. And this seems to be something mainly for people in India because apparently they get a lot of spam calls which is kind of ironic since it's Indians that always spam call Americans with scams and stuff. So I don't know, that's kind of weird. I imagine it's much worse in India uh, because it says right here, this will uh, be massively useful to iPhone owners in India and will instantly please the telecom authority regulator of India, TRAI. Uh, so if we scroll down just a bit here, you guys can see uh, nuisance calls and spam texts are a big problem, uh, especially in India. Um, and with this new change, iPhone owners will be able to report nuisance calls directly from the call log of their device with a simple swipe thanks to a new unwanted communication extension capability that will give third-party developers the chance to build apps which access the call logs and messages app. So we really have to see how this is going to be used because uh, if this is used where these developers can see the call logs, like all of your logs that you don't report or something like that, that could get a little bit invasive and I personally would not use it. I don't get that many spam calls as it is right now, uh, knock on wood, but for those that do, I'm sure this will be a very welcomed uh, addition. So uh, from the SMS perspective, the same type of functionality will apply. A user will be able to swipe directly on the message in the messages app or even select multiple messages at one time and choose to report them all as spam or nuisance communications. Apple may not have talked about this new feature during WWDC, but has described the functionality as follows. So pretty much exactly what I just said. Um, so that's kind of cool there that they're doing this. So uh, let me know below if you guys would use this. Um, I'm not really sure what difference this would make. Like once you report it, uh, who does it go to? Which authorities? Um, at least for here in the US, I don't know who it would go to exactly maybe the FCC or something. But it's cool that Apple's thinking about this and adding it uh, baked in iOS 12. Uh, so we'll see how it works. Uh, I'm excited to see it, but I might not use it if, uh, it depends how this protocol is being used because again, if it's you know allowing third-party developers to see your call logs and your messages logs, that's a no-go for me. Uh, but that's all I got for this video, guys. If you liked it, hit it with a big thumbs up, subscribe, hit that little bell icon so you don't miss any of our videos, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.